you go. Uh, 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 Frisco fried or Auntie's April? Auntie April's. Her her waffles are pretty dope. Uh -huh. And if I gotta pick E forty or Mac Dre, I'm picking Mac Dre. Mac Dre, you answered that. But E forty is cool. I, I yeah. fuck with forty, but I'm yeah. rocking with um the mm -hmm. it. Raquel. Raquel, welcome to the barbershop, Queen. Any thoughts on the news that Viacom has terminated their business relationship with Nick Cannon after I he, do. After oh, I he refused to apologize like Deshaun Jackson did? I just heard about this right now. And I think so, that this is I just, come yeah, together. We, and we say, screw y'all. Screw your platform. We're going to create our own because don't be mad at him telling the truth. Like in Nick Cannon is super talented. He got wilding out. You got your following. Take your platform and ownership. Right. Ownership, ownership. That's why I created the Pretty Beast brand. That's why I do what I do. That's why uh, I refuse to let people uh, tell me out. I'm uh, gonna do it myself because it's ownership, and that's how you pass yeah. down generational wealth to your family. So screw them. We all need to get behind Nick Cannon. We all need to go and follow Nick Cannon and say, "We got you. We support you. Where do we pull our dollars at? How do we create a platform for you? How do we buy our own station and not know BET because it's not black owned anyway, yeah. and it's putting bull crap to our communities and to our people." So I'm pissed off about it. I'm fired up about it. And I think that this is when we make our black dollars count. This is when we say, nope, not us. Y'all want to shut him off? Then we're not going to spend with y'all company. We're not going to watch none of y'all shows. We don't want to see none of y'all trash reality shows. Mm -hmm. No. If you're an influencer and you ain't got nothing to influence to get up out the way. Right. There's too many people in the way right now. Yeah. Period. If you're not a pushing the culture, you're not keeping it real, you got to go. Oh, facts. Big facts. I couldn't agree with you more. I skipped the super chat. If I did, put it in the comment section. I apologize. We'll get to the super chat, then we'll get to the phone call. This is fire. Salute to my bro, Barbershop Conversation, the Queen Champ, the Pretty Beast, Miss Miller. You got to go on Blue Bud show during the Blue day. Blue Bud, holler. Hit me up. Send me a message. Let's I'll go. give you her sister's email. Like I'm telling you, you're going to be a rock star in this month. I'm telling you, dog. I'm not lying. You're going to be a rock star. What's up, town? Go ahead. Man, what up, Fred? Uh huh. Hey, what's up, Raquel? Hey, what's up? Just wanted to show you some Bay Area love, you know, coming from the other side of the water, East Oakland's finest, you know. Okay. Uh, you know, I know you. Yeah, I know you through uh, Kareem and uh, Troy. So That's you know, I went to your fight in Frisco, you know, uh, at the um, at the, uh, the hotel at the top of the hill. So, you know, I already met you a few times. Okay. So, you know, I'm just glad that you finally getting your shine. And uh, Fred is the perfect person to blow you up because Fred did made a couple of stars out of uh, everybody. He helped Fred helped me. Fred helped my channel grow. He taught me. Fred taught me some things. He helped helped me become a better a better interviewer and stuff. So Fred helps people. He's down for the cause. You know what I'm saying? Me and Fred don't always see eye to eye, but Fred is a real nigga out here. He's fighting for us. Mm. So you know, so this is the perfect person to blow you up. And you know, Raquel, I fuck with you because you from Frisco. One of my favorite uh, albums is the Hitman Solo Creep. Mm. The album, you know, I so, you know, I know all about Skull City. So you know, mm -hmm. I'm saying I got a lot of family up there. You know what I'm saying? So I know all about Frisco, and I'm glad that you're getting the shine because you deserve the shine because you're a beautiful black woman. I love how you represent our people. And if anybody don't know the Bay, we culture. We we about the culture. We about the family. We about our people. You know what I'm saying? We about having stuff. So, you know what I'm saying? I really hope that fight between you and Carissa. It has to happens. happen. I'm 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 gonna be torn. I'm gonna be torn, Raquel. I will be at the fight, but you know what? I, I gotta keep it Bay Area. I'm gonna be fucking with you. You know what I'm be, I, I gotta keep it Bay Area. I gotta keep it Bay Area. I gotta get yeah. the area because it. I, I got to. I'm gonna have to roll with you, no, no. Carissa. But it's five one zero to the four one five. Period. <laughs> <laughs> and then, Fred, check your email. My sister sent you over the anthem. So before I go, you gotta let the people okay. hear it too. All right. All right. All right. But I appreciate you. Thank you. You know your energy. I'm sending you nothing but love, light, and abundance. And I just appreciate this. The energy is just definitely good. And I'm just super just thankful to hear so many people coming on, talking about us, supporting each other, and us having each other's back because that's what's really missing. And it really feel really hard out here when you grinding and you pushing and you're trying to do so many things and you feel like your people not there having your back and supporting you. So thank you, God. I appreciate y'all. 